what is up you guys welcome back to my channel this is luna over here so i'm filming a day in my life video right now it's about 9 20 o'clock in the morning um i'm preparing some paperwork and cma for a listing appointment at 10 o'clock so some of you guys has asked me what do i typically bring to a listing appointment um there are two type of listing appointment one is i'm very confident that they're going to sign usually i'll bring the whole package including the consumer notice the listing agreement and also seller property disclosure and the let paint however if i'm not sh so sure about the listing appointment i don't know if they're going to sign with me i usually just bring the listing agreement have them sign at the spot if they are signing with me and then i'll go back and bring the rest of paperwork or have them come in drop off the key and then also sign the rest of paperwork so just finished my listing appointment i did sign it it took like an hour so i'm right now at the gas station about to get some gas what's up i got the listing yes whoa don't don't whoa because the price is not <clears throat> that good no yeah it's he doesn't I told him I said I don't think it worth that much I already told him how much I think it worth um, and then he said it's fine he just want to put it up a few moments later I honestly don't know how to start my office got robbed about a month ago i haven't really talked anything about it just because it's, it was an ongoing investigation um basically what happened was i was the first a few people that found out so i came to work like any other normal day i just felt like the back door was open so i saw a police car just pulled up the same time as i did so i went up and i was like hey officer and then he's like you need to step out because this is a crime scene i'm like what and i told him i said i work here and um i was the very last few people that left last night so he thought that i was some sort of witness so he let me in i introduced him i was like well that's my office i went in and the place was kind of trashed and there's like computer everywhere it was on the floor and i see my postcard was like everywhere on the on the floor um it was kind of scary because i have never experienced something like that before um but luckily we didn't really lose a lot of like there's not that much damage and that much loss i still don't really feel comfortable talking about the details but you know that was just some, something that happened to us um now we everybody is more cautious we have a security alarm so everything is okay and um um yeah so that's just kind of what happened i mean it's not it's it's crazy to think about you know how it would actually like personally affect me um, it just felt like your privacy was invaded. Like somebody came into my office, they did damage, and my file was everywhere. You know, it's not pleasant, but I just kind of want to give you guys, you know, especially women out there, just to be very cautious and, you know, always let people know your location, where you are with listing appointment, and personally, you know, carry like, either a taser or some sort of you know pepper spray and just be very cautious with your surroundings don't do really any, don't do any buyers anymore but um if you do do showing with strangers please make sure that you have their id and pre-approved letter so that way you secure you secure who that person is their identity and if you're doing a listing appointment make sure you do a background check 
you know, see if that person has any criminal background. Um, and then also just match up on the public record, see if the person that you're seeing is the actual person who owns the property and let your coworker and your family know where you are at all time. I share my location with like my broker at all time. So yeah, just kind of, you know, give you guys an update. Um, have you done any upgrades to the property since you purchased it? Since I purchased it, nah. <laughs> yes. I just got a referral from an agent and I roughly did a CMA, but I always, if Joey is in office, I always like to, you know, go through with him just to make sure I didn't make any mistakes. So I'm gonna go ask him, but he's on the phone. This video, when karma hits, hits you harder than ever. So it's basically saying, like someone is behaving like an asshole. And I see this guy, he like kicked his cat off the chair and then just like kicked the cat away and the cat went above the stairs and there's like a plant, no the plant right above him and then hit him while he was playing the guitar. Yeah. See me at the playground where they go spray rounds. No, I've been to Brown Town, so I'm hit some Brown Town. Catch me at the comic house, blow big dope by the ounce. Ow, on your floor, Luigi. Hit up with the speed, she feeling all her GGs. Catch me at the comic house, blow big dope by the ounce. Keep scratching, don't stop. All right, let's go. You're cute. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, just gonna have this protein shake and make some dinner. And um, I think I'm just gonna go to sleep. It's about 6.30. Um, I think when it gets closer to the holidays, I'm gonna be doing a lot more vlogs for you guys. So stay tuned for that. And thank you so much for watching the video. I'll see you guys in the next one.